Mojang just released a new Minecraft 1.19 update and to capitalize on profit as much as possible off their hard work, we're going to be remaking the entire update. Let's get started. Right off the bat, let's do the warden. I actually think he'd look better hand drawn. This is this is going to be the face. Yep, exactly the look I was going for. Wow, this is so aesthetically pleasing. Reminds me of my PC setup. Homemade. Yep, my PC setup does that as well. Uh, while we're in the mood, let's also tweak some other things in the deep dark. Yep, these things are already horrible, but I think we can definitely do better. Yep, perfect. That's exactly what I was looking for. Let's close out of that. I could come up with something to change these blocks into myself, or I could leave it up to a random word generator. Restaurant, what a good idea. Oh, that was pretty big, but I think we can actually leave it like this. Oh, cool, the deep dark is so much more lively and happy now. Please also sponsor me, McDonald's. And for the icing on the cake, I made it so you can see absolutely nothing upon entering the biome. I felt like the update needed a bit more difficulty, you know. Another big addition everyone was excited for was frogs. Let's improve them a bit. First change we're gonna do is just increase the, the size of it uh, slightly, of course. Yep, this is a very good start. Not quite positive to why the tongue is at the back now. Just fix that real quick. It's definitely taken in many milligrams of radiation, but other than that, it's it's quite similar. Oh, yeah, no, that that's definitely something. I am definitely not as excited for these to be added anymore. The fact that a frog's body can consume this much radiation without collapsing is very impressive. I want you to take a quick look at the mangrove swamp. What does this look like to you? The slum areas of Slovakia, exactly what I was thinking. We need to give it a bit more color and vibrance. Kind of like this, actually. Starting with the trees, okay. Yeah, just paint that everywhere. Okay, the logs are complete. I feel like there are already too many leaf types that are green. So I made them red. Oh, yeah, no, it, it seems to have gone through. I vaguely recall this being red, and now it seems to be brown. Minor details. Yeah, I, I think we succeeded. Oh, right, I see now. This is where the red leaves ended up. And they seem to have affected every other biome's leaf generation as well. Yep, even the jungles have been affected. You know how mud is like this color? However, it could also be this color. We have definitely caused enough irreversible damage to the wildlife. Um, mission successful. The boat with a chest is cool if you want to transport this many items across the ocean. However, I don't think that's very efficient. Instead, we are going to get something a bit bigger and more efficient. $450. What a steal. Uh, 20 minutes later, uh, here it is. That this, this, yep. RMS Titanic in Minecraft. Worth every penny. I'm really loving the interior. Oh, it's gone. Goats aren't new for this update, but they urgently need a texture overhaul. So we'll make an exception. Actually, this looks way too complicated. For everyone's simplicity, let's just uh, grab the sheep texture. Yep, ex exactly like that. Oh, no. What have I done? No, look at the fa What? No. What? I, I'm so sorry. Okay, I, I, I've definitely crossed the line. This is this is way too far. Okay, uh, guys, uh, just enjoy your set. Bye. Personally, I'd say the recovery compass was a, a, a very good addition to Minecraft. You know, you could find where you died and, and stuff like that. However, do you really want to give people the chance to retrieve their items? I think that is way too overpowered. So you see all these different recovery compasses. Wouldn't it be a very funny prank if we made all of them point downwards? Absolutely magnificent. I'm gonna send this texture pack to everyone I know. They're gonna forget about it until one day they need to recover their items. And then the recovery compass is just, it's just not gonna do anything. This is the pinnacle of resource pack development. Do you know what's wrong with this block? 
It's called the pearlescent frog light block, but there are no signs of any frogs. Awful, actually. Look how easy that was, Mojang. This is gonna be my new go-to building block. So they changed some things about the wandering trader in this update. Like that he no longer opens and closes doors. Why not change him some more? It was about time to get rid of him. He's basically gone now. Selling grossly overpriced items to children is not an okay business practice. Except when I do it. When I do it, it's okay. A huge complaint absolutely everyone had was that there were not enough music discs added in the new version. So I took matters into my own hands. And just like that, two new bangers have been added. Computer fan sounds? And door opening closing noises movement one. And yes, that does imply that there will be a movement two. This really brings a tear to my eye. Also, it goes on for 10 hours. In spirit of the recently removed wandering trader, no idea how that happened. We're adding the wandering trader tool set in memory of him. That's a really nice shaft. Very practical and easy to hold. Okay, that's the pickaxe complete. <laughs> no, this is so ugly. <coughs> anyway, crafted with two sticks and three dirt, the wandering trader pickaxe is truly an essential tool for any Minecrafter. It's also really fast at mining. Then there is the wandering trader sword, the shovel also really fast, the axe very beautiful, does not look like vomit or anything, and finally the hoe. Beautiful. You're gonna have to hear me out on this one. These yellow lights are more popular than these other white lights, right? And applying that same logic to Minecraft, it would only make sense that snow and every single other white object turns yellow. I have gone completely off the rails. This is the new snow block. Beautiful, save. Now let me just do it for all of these as well. That should be all of them. Let's see how modern and good it looks in game. Oh no, this is some Chernobyl type stuff right here. <laughs> no, I've literally ruined the entire ecological system. I'm so sorry. We also have the new white stained glass, the new white wool, the white terracotta, uh, the white beds. I don't quite know what happened here. They still work and are very comfortable. Now that I think about it, this is perfectly in time with the release of the new Minion movie. Welcome to the Minion update. There is nothing I hate more than the alley, and to take out my anger, we're gonna make some practical changes, like elongating its body, relocating the wings, adding some big spherical eyes. Have you figured out where this is going yet? And just like that, we have just performed plastic surgery on the alley, making it into a fly. Because realism is what Minecraft is about, and nightmares. Uh, uh, uh. Subcribe.